about technology is our key to do that. So we train students in kindergarten through eighth grade in technology and it becomes content relevant. The younger students learn the computers and keyboard. My older students, I'm getting them ready to move on into high school. They know how to do spreadsheets, databases, word processing, and we talk about how that can apply to their lives. Um, we do newsletters, we create a yearbook. Um, some of them are learning on their own. They help other community members on how to fix their computer, so it's a potential business. And then we received a grant, gosh, it just seems like yesterday, but it's been about five years ago, um, where we have adult education in the evening. And it's been very popular. We have more students than we have seats for. So we do two different classes every quarter. And I have volunteers that do most of the instruction from the community. And my room is busy like four or five nights a week. So we have adult ed, we have um, 4-H comes in here one day a week, and then um, that's about it, I guess. But we're busy all the time. So we have, we to 80 or so utilize this lab. And wasn't it originally in partnership with a community college? Jeff, well, um, I still try to collaborate with our higher education. Distance learning in Jefferson County is wonderful because we aren't close to any university. So it offers um, access to many of the colleges that offer online classes. And so we try to accommodate that. Sometimes students will come down at 6.30 in the morning with me so that they can access the class or they can use time in the evening during a lab time to access it. We just try to keep it available at all times, and um, I'm just very fortunate that we have a wonderful volunteer group so that everybody sort of takes a turn at doing it. And people love coming in. They want us to do it more. We're like, oh, we need some vacation, but um, we've been real lucky that way. One of the classes we had this year that was by community request was digital photography. So my community members who are interested in that helped instruct it. Um, people sit in here and it's it's time to go and we have to say, okay, class is over. And then, oh, a little bit longer. But I think it's just because it's, it's very cozy and my um, volunteers are friendly. And we always have them be evaluated at the end and they, they get really high marks. So... We're just very fortunate. Excellent volunteers. I'm actually in that class. <laughs> oh, good. And I'm tell me what you think. I think it's fabulous. Yeah, good. You know, I've used a computer at least 20 years mm -hmm. without knowing how. There you go. There you go. And so tell me, tell them what you think of. I know what I hear about our volunteers, but what I am amazed to come to such a tiny place and to have four instructors present at every class. So that means that they're hands on with you. They're right there with you. And they're very interested in what we're interested in so that we can apply it practically. And they're all learning because there are so many different ways to do things like computers.